Reggie, what's going on? Friends, hello. Oh my days, it has been such a long time coming. According to YouTube, I got an email from YouTube yesterday. It's been 98 days since I last vlogged. So welcome back, how you all doing? Okay, I've just had to change the camera because in typical Frost fashion, my um, the batteries that I had for the previous camera are all dead. So you're now on, or we are now on the GoPro. Anyway, friends, as I was saying, it's so lovely to see you. Welcome back to the vlogs. Um, got a bit of a huge unboxing to do. Um, so I thought this would be the perfect occasion to um, get the vlogs back up and running. And we're now into March, um, so hopefully the weather is going to improve massively. So myself and Ames can start getting outside and riding. I know she did her first ride with Kate and Nige outside on Thursday. I've not ridden outside since October when we were in Mallorca, which is just bonkers just because the weather's been so shite. Uh, but I've been doing lots and lots of Zwifting, lots of running, swimming and gym work. So it's all good, I can't complain. Anyway, back to the unboxing, look at this. It's not a huge guitar. It is a rocker plate by Lifeline, which I'm very lucky because Ames has brought this for me as, um, as a present really. It arrived yesterday. So we're going to unbox it. I've just taken the wrappings off. I've not actually taken it um, out or sort of looked under the covers, as it were. Um, it's a Lifeline rocker plate uh, to use with Zwift. Um, they, it's from Wiggle, just to let you know. I saw an advert a few days ago. Um, I've been looking at these for a good couple of months and they were originally priced at around £250 but they've been reduced to 99.99. And I said to Owens, my days, that is such a bargain. And she very kindly ordered it for me. So here it is. So let's peel back the cardboard cover and take a look. Oh, there's Reggie again. Reggie coming to have a look. He doesn't like boxes. Not this kind of unboxing anyway. Reg, should we take the cover off? It's all right, come here, look. Oh, look at that, friends, that looks amazing. Let me just put this camera down while I shift this off so I don't scare Reggie. Look at that, it's out of the box. Reggie's run upstairs because he was scared of the big box. It is absolutely huge. I don't really, oh look, I don't really know what I expected the size to be. Look at that, friends. Absolutely amazing. Oh my God. You've come to see now, Rich. You are such a clever boy. I'm loving the look of that. Ames is just downstairs in the, she's in the pain cave, so we'll give her a shout and she can help me um, take it downstairs. There's Maisie. Say hi, Maisie Moose. So here it is, here is the Lifeline rocker plate. Doesn't it look blooming impressive? They're my slipper socks. Such a lovely finish, and who's that? <coughs> Hello, I have a cold, I'm so sorry. <coughs> but apart, How's everyone? Apart from your cold, how are you feeling? Yeah, I know, good. Excellent. Very fit, thank you. This is good, you've been doing so much swimming, running and swifting. You're on it. There's uh, Ames' set up with a- With the hedgehogs. Oh yes, now we'll have to do a separate vlog about these, but these are the hedgehogs. Cheap and cheerful. About 20 pound for six, and they are a, basically a, a cheaper version of having a rocker plate. And that's it, that's it, because we've just moved it. We have just moved the uh, trainer on top of Ames, his new Zwift mat. But you love those hedgehogs, don't you? <laughs> yeah. Under my the spotlight. My butt was struggling so bad. Look, I look like a Halloween thing. Oh, come on. I, um, I find it so... The saddle, obviously, is completely different to sitting on something like this. Yeah, yeah. And, I, and I've been really struggling to get more than two hours on the bike. Mm. Even like 25 minutes in and I was like... Dying. You were struggling, yeah. And these little hedgehog things... Because I didn't want to go to Rocker Plate. 
No. I like. I wanted to try. Like I have my really cheap road bike. Yeah. And we did loads of vlogs with him with Sherman from yes from a couple of days about three years ago. I wanted to go cheap and cheerful, and just show that you can improvise. Yeah. Safe as houses as well. It looks and they bit... are brilliant. Yeah, they're as safe as houses. I was a bit dubious. A, a Ninety minutes, and I'm not not feeling the saddle at all. Yeah. Well, and... You use me as a test pilot. <laughs> yeah, you tried you tried them out first because I was a bit unsure, you but it's going to fall off. Nineteen ninety nine for those. Um, they're called hedgehogs from um, Amazon. We we found out about them from Zwift Beginners Facebook page. Yeah, and I I, I sent you the link, didn't I? Yeah. So let's give this a go. And um, they've been a revelation, haven't they? Honestly, and I actually think they say you lose a bit of power, but I don't think that's true because if your butt's hurting, you can't you can't drive yourself along anyway because you're trying to not sit on your butt yeah not yeah not wanting to be like graphic but i think i've gained more power because i can actually get a solid base on the bike now mm. and the bike moves quite a lot yeah i mean i don't i don't tend to stand up and and um, ride on that but i have stood up on it and, and you I'm, i can push like maybe up to 600 watts in bursts yeah and it's still stable yeah which is brilliant they just create and they're jazzy they are jazzy and they just create um you know a bit of cushioning to mimic um you're riding outside basically in the movement the the general movement of your bike naturally uh, I'm, i am going to try put them under the front because you can attach them to the board and have them under the front oh, okay but that's that's a bit too advanced for me. yeah anywho so we best crack on because yeah. we've got a Ames has got to go to work, <coughs> and um, yeah, we That's, need to get it, this all. And my stuff's boring. This is very exciting. This is exciting. It looks and, amazing. Uh, I'm probably freaking people out with the toe socks. No, you're, no one probably even noticed. But in the bag, with the rocker plate, you get a spirit level. Any spirit level. You get a pump. You get these inflatable balls, which are obviously just hedgehogs. Just hedgehogs, but without the spikes. And then the straps, so we're going to read the instructions and try and get it set up. Well, you'll read the instructions. Okay, but, but I'm I, a man. I, I won't. I don't read instructions. <laughs> I don't either. Oh my god, Macy! Right, so here it is, the rocker plate in all its glory. I've not tried it yet. I'm about to get on Zwift and give it a go. I've got the two balls, one there and one there. So I've inflated them to the sort of PSI I think is okay. And then look. Look at this. Oh my god, it's amazing. So I'm all dressed for success and we're going to give it a go. See what it's like. A bit out of breath. <laughs> Just done 14 and a half miles. The rocker plate is brilliant. First go, first impressions, really good. 
That wasn't your first go though, was it, Mark? Oh no, my first go, that's true. <laughs> my first go, I hadn't inflated the balls enough. So I was like rocking all over the place, not like status quo. More like Frankie Howard. <laughs> More like Frankie Howard, yeah. <laughs> there was a lot of ooze. Um, so I increased the pressure in both the balls and it's so much better it's really good it's just going to take a bit of getting used to I think but um, yeah I'm loving it so far how are you getting on missus? budget corner budget corner with your hedgehogs keeping it real keeping it real budget corner yeah but it's good right? the most expensive bike on a bit of cheap Chinese chat <laughs> Wow. Taiwanese chat. And there's Maisie. She doesn't really care. She didn't want to go in her new space by the road, did she? No. No. That, do you want me to do it from here so you can see it? Go on then. Hand over the baton. You can't see really because I'm wobbling. I bet the camera doesn't really pick it up anyway. Well, I'm wobbling so. Yeah. There you go. But yeah, first thoughts, I really love it. So we'll see how we go over the next week or so. But yeah, reduced to 99 quid. It's brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Right, friends, it's so lovely to see you all again. Sorry it's been 98 days since my last vlog. Is that it? 98 yeah. days? Yeah. Wow. I got an email from YouTube yesterday. What, saying we're going to turn your channel off and turn it? No. <laughs> But uh, I shall see you in a vlog in a few days. Hope you're well, hope you're good. Stay safe out there. Bye from Ains. Bye. Bye from me. See you soon. <laughs>